Hello everyone, Hiei here, back at you with another video. Um, so today I have um, a little haul of stuff that I got for Christmas, and also some Black Friday, or like Small Business Saturday kind of stuff that I got from individual people around the holiday season. So I thought that I'd show those off to you guys. Uh, I hope everybody had a happy holiday. Um, Hope everyone stayed safe. Um, I'm sure this holiday season has been quite rough on so many people. Um, I know personally the holidays have not been the same for me since 2019. Really, <laughs> you skip me years. But um, yeah, so I hope everyone at least just had a decent day that day um, and everything. So first I'll show off the stuff that I got from my parents um so that'll show i don't have everything to show uh, so one of the things i got which i laughed at was uh this beaver skull so my dad got me this um he actually got me one last year i like this one it has so like um it looks like it might have been um boiled or bleached um, because unfortunately the teeth and everything are quite broken, um, or it's just a craft grade skull, but, um, I'll probably use that for other projects, um, so I'm not certain yet what I'm going to do with it, but I already have another one that, um, he got me last year, I believe, which I think is actually right behind me, um, but I got that last year from him, so I actually laughed because the first year we moved here, I found my own. Um, skull of a beaver uh, and some bones um, and I was out looking for bones and then my dad got me one last year like a beaver skull and then he got me another one so I was kind of laughing at that but he's got me two now but I'll still use that and then for my mom I got this is a patch I got from Hound Saint from my mom um, and then she also got me um, a cross stitch holder that I need to get a table so I can actually use it and um, to put on my chair and um, some fabric that just came in yesterday um, to, so I can use that. So I love the patch though. I'm going to totally put that on a jacket or something. Um, so maybe figure out what I'm doing with all my patches. But yeah, I was actually, I really like that version actually, now that I've seen it in person, because originally I wanted the black fabric with white um, print on it. Um, and they were sold out of that one, so I got that one. And I actually really love the way that one looks, so I'm actually kind of glad that I got that one. And then from my friend in Phoenix, um, I got some hot chocolate and socks um, and then I also got this little guy from uh, my freelance job so super cute and then I have stuff that I picked up around the holidays for um, so one of them um, which is like the first one I got is from um, Dark North Craft and Curio Kate um, and it is a little tiny ceramic Christmas tree it's missing some of the lights but it's still super cute so. but I love it so that was that's been displayed um, throughout the Christmas season um, and then I also picked up from Brad Redwood. I think I bought this on Black Friday, but I think um, the one that I originally wanted um, was sold out really quick. Like I had it in my cart and was about to pay and it was sold out. So I got this one now. Super cool pen. I love his work. It's so awesome. Then, from the 
card. I got this really cute little hedgehog wet specimen. It's this little uh, fetal hedgehog. Oh, where is it? Sam. Glare. The glare is like, no, we don't want you to see him. That'd be super cute. Um, I'm going to get him a different jar that's smaller. He fits in a little bit better, but I just have this jar in handy to put him in. For now. And then from Ash CK that I follow on uh, Instagram, um, I got this Mothman. I love Mothman. Mothman is like my favorite cryptid. Um, I have another Mothman plush coming that I found on Etsy and I was like, oh, it's adorable, I need it. Because I need more Mothman in my life, apparently. So there he is. Super cool. I love him. So he will probably hang out somewhere. I don't know where. But I might even give him one of my dolls to hold. And then from... From Cherish Hearth Art, I got this really cool pop socket. Um, I need to get a new plain um, case for my phone so I can actually put this on it. Use it, but it's super cool um, art pop socket. Um, and since I probably won't be dropping my phone as much now. Um, I was like, you know what, I can probably get away with that. Um, and it came with a little card thing. So, it says, uh, thank you so much for your support. It truly means the world to me. I hope you like your Memento Mori pop, uh, Memento Mori grip. Happy holidays. So, super awesome. Um, I was glad to support and get that. Because it's super cool. It's like a little mini art piece in itself. Um, I will use it because um, I most likely won't be damaging it. If it looks like I might damage it, um, I'll probably just take it off and just display it instead. But I probably will be okay using it. And then I also got this um, lighter clay case. Um, so it's super cool. I need to get lighters that actually fit it because supposed to be able to hold BIC lighters, um, and the ones that I bought were not BIC. They're a different version, but they said that they were the same size, and they're not, so didn't quite fit. So, and that's uh, carved, and that is from, and that is from Thomas Kuntz. So, and I'll put information down below, too. And then from Bay Curiosities. Um, I got this, um, the creamery. This, um, is from, the creamery is the artist, and I got it from Bay Curiosities. Um, and it's just this wall plaque thing. And it is just a religious thing, but with a raccoon. And uh, it says COVID-19 COVID made me. And then it has the uh, little thing. So I got that. And then I got this cool sticker and some extras from um, Lynn Go. Lynn Go. Um, so see the information on the back um, and I got a postcard for the same thing but I don't know where I put it um, so oh, I have a sticker a postcard and the sticker will be turned into a magnet so that's what I always do not that I have a fridge yet to put them on but once I do maybe just get make a magnet board to like hang them up and then it came with some extra little um, stickers. So. I love their work, 
so I was like snagging that because it's so cool. And then from Scavenge Parts, I got this uh, awesome bottle. So it has two faces and it does open up. So I just saw this. I was just scrolling through Etsy one day and I was and I saw that they had added new items and I like went to just just see their shop and I saw it and I just fell in love with it. I was just like that is just so creepy and so weird. I love it. So I had to own it and uh, that was a place in my room already. Um, it's freaking awesome. I mean, my weird. And then from um, Puddles and Poison, um, I got this Lucerna tea strainer. Um, so it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, like this strainer is so pretty. Um, so I look forward to using this to. Uh, make tea. I haven't actually used it yet um, just because I can't keep stuff down in the kitchen. Um, so it's really awkward to like have to bring it all the way down. Um, I struggle down the stairs to go into the kitchen. So for now it's just in my room. Um, but eventually um, I will be able to use it. So and then from Dominguez Dreams, I'm pronouncing that right? Demurcus Dreams, I think is what it is. Um, I got this dragon sculpture thing. Um, I believe it's made of clay. Um, once again, it doesn't want to focus. But that's super cool. Um, so I'm going to paint this. Um, so it came blank and you can paint it. And I was like, oh, cool. Um, I think that'd be cool to do is just paint it. But yeah, so I get to paint that, so it was cool. So that was it for this little haul for you guys. Um, hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, um, feel free to drop a like. Um, subscribe if you haven't and you want to see more from me. Um, don't post too often, unfortunately, um, because of medical issues I have. Um, I'm not always able to post regularly, unfortunately, but um, I am here occasionally uh, dropping a video, try to post as regularly as I can. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching, and as always, peace out.